to give us more updates on Nigerians who were evacuated from Ukraine via Bucharest Airport in Romania. Is our eyes correspondent Mary Chinga is on ground after that as we are listening to some of the returning. Mary, good morning, and thank you for joining us on the morning show. Good morning, Ruben. Good morning. Okay. Good morning, Ruben. Good morning. Can you hear me? So the way you are calling Ruben, Ruben, yes, it's like you are at my at my naming ceremony <laughs> when I was born many years ago. But carry on. What's the situation <laughs> report out there? Okay, so stu um, students here are basically. Uh, is the process smooth? Or are they going Ruben. through extraordinary stress Ruben. on their arrival? Ruben, I would say that the Nigerian authorities are generally warm. Their posture is that of, you know, them being warm to receive this Nigerian student who actually look very exhausted and in need of love and all of the all of the kindness they can actually get from the Nigerian government. All hands are on deck right here, and uh, they, they're giving them their best. All right, thank you so much. Okay, sir. thank you, uh, Mary. I see you are in love with my name. We like to keep coming, okay? When I see you, I will tell you my history in this profession, okay? All right, it's time for a short break on the it's morning show. Now, when we're talking morning show, yeah, on our rise. Joining us now to review some of the headlines of today's newspapers from around the world is a rise news analyst, Emmanuel Ifeni. Good morning, Mr. Ifeni. <laughs> Good morning, Ruben. You know, I'm going to be one of those who could have attended you <laughs> in the new ceremony. <laughs> well, we just added uh, Mary Chinda to that list. <laughs> of the privileged ones who can tell you who got that list. <laughs> you know, just leave it at that. <laughs> just, just leave it at that, you know? Well, good morning, Rufa. Okay. <laughs>